So we want to talk a little bit, I think if you've watched any of our stuff, you've probably seen us talk about teaching clean, teaching the hand clean, but what we don't have a clip of is probably the biggest change that we've made. It, when we look for this on the internet, we can't seem to isolate out this little Glenn Pendley clip that we need. And it was interesting, Robbie Bork talked on the strengthcoach.com site about this was the big change that he had made, and it's really the big change that we've made from a teaching standpoint too. And basically, what we used to do, if you can imagine, is we would tell somebody, okay, wrist rolled under, shoulders back, slide the bar down to about a mid-five position. That was how we were gonna teach somebody to hang clean. From watching Glenn Pendley's videos, what we've realized, and he does a little bit better than us, and it's a better first preliminary step, is we're thinking, same idea, underhook, shoulders back, but instead of sliding the bar down the thigh, all he's gonna ask them to do is just bend their knees. So now I'm in a situation where actually my chest is a little bit behind the bar, and from there, then I'm just gonna execute that quick jump, shrug, catch kind of action, and eventually, and it was funny, I watched him do it on video, and I wanna make sure he gets full credit, but he'll just say posture, and boom, athletes are right there where they wanna be. And then he'll say knees, and it brought me back to that Kevin McNair tape that we were talking about in terms of speed development. So all of a sudden, posture, knees, and then boom, jump. And I'm getting what I want. So I think this is a much better way to teach that first step. Once I get that, boom, then we can shift to getting our chest out over the bar, slide the bar down the thighs. But this is gonna be a way better way to start with really anybody, any athlete, I don't care whoever you're trying to teach to Olympic lift.